Hey everyone, Sun Temaga here, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation. In the last episode, we entered a glowy kind of door and wound up in a mysterious courtyard with a mansion. And now both Venom, Lenny, Luca, and of course me. We're kidnapped by a bunch of mates because we're going to use it some kind of ritual. And we met some unknown girl. Who we could have actually seen before, but I chose not to look at the prologue from the first episode. And she freed us from some sort of weird acid trip. Or what the heck was going on with us. Anyway, in today's episode, we'll be trying to get our friends back. And thankfully, they were kind enough to leave a PC here. Wait, what? The purified chamber? I gotta look at this. Oh. Okay, there's no point in me purified, but that's kind of new. I don't think I remember seeing that in um, version 12. I think I still have to go back to um, Sheridan Village to do that. But hey, I know now. Okay, so, passwords. I have put in three, excuse me, four different type of passwords. There, I can't do anything with them right now. Right here we have full EVs, full IVs, minty fresh, and power pack. Um, to be highly honest, I feel like now I just wasted my time putting these passwords in because First off, I need data drives, and they're not available for quite some time. I think like maybe until like, don't really remember, I think maybe the 6th gym badge? I think, I actually don't know for sure. Uh, but anyway, for what some of these do here is that you can put in the password, and when you get the data drives, you can choose like, power pack, which um, gives you all the um, Eevee cards at the hotel without the to again achievement points. Uh, Minty Fresh gives you every single mint item, like every single one from. And I can find some, but yeah, like that's how it works. Minty Fresh gives you every mint for every ability. Full IVs basically means that um, you have to catch your Pokemon that are all already fully six IV. I however don't remember what the full EVs do. Anyway I can go for my PC but jeez right now my Pokemon needs some health. Is there any way for me to heal? There's a mural of a blonde of a blonde haired girl with a ponytail. Well, I could use some health though. Hmm, maybe it'll be wise if I change out my Pokemon real quick. Actually, wait, I want to see if this can work still. Raxian, you'll be a good, you'll be a good enough experiment for this. Okay, yep. Okay, this is something I never ever once mentioned, but if your Pokemon have are low on health. Let's say, of course, Rata or have fainted. You can just simply put them in the PC and they'll be fully healed. And also, their BP points will also be restored. However, this does not work for every PC. Sometimes there's just moments, at least I remember from the mainline games, where the PC won't fully heal. Let's see, I believe. Did you pass? Did you fail as well? Not really. What about you? And we have some um, potions, some potions, so we can just. Oh wow, I got a hyper potion. Yeah, a lot of gourmet treats.
See, do I have any paralyzed heals, heals at all? No, not really, but I can use the um, Castle Leap. Castle. Basically, this ice cream come here can be used to heal up your pump, any of your status problems. Sounds like the lava rock. You know what? Let me just deal with Spirit Tomb. Just do this. Then there we go. Also, I still want um, Kubat to be remaining out first, so that way I can get its friendship points up. A locked door. We best better remember that door. Now that we're free, we can actually um, explore the mansion. And just like he said, even if you were to try to abandon your own friends, you cannot leave at all. Okay, never mind. We can still leave if we want to. Even though the guy said that we can't leave. He just bloody lied to me. How cruel. How oh, such a cruel, cruel person could do this to me. Oh wow, there's actually wild counters here. Okay, I guess we'll take care of this then. Okay, first up we have Plusso. Not even that good. Even the Della Bows don't recommend it. Let's move on. Love it when I can't just simply run away. Well, let me go right here. Go up a bit more. Oh, we got Lolan me out. Um, I would say I much prefer either normal me out or Delarian me out. So I'm gonna skip this one. Oh, the freaking course! I can't freaking run away. Okay, finally. Sheesh. It was just, it was just a constant. A low in me up well, after another. My goodness gracious. Anyway, here we have Skip Loom. Um, you know what? I used Skip Loom before, but well, mainly it's uh, evolution. So, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna capture this Skip Loom here. Plus, I found a bet that I wouldn't be able to get the Skip Loom at all in the future. I mean, well, I'm probably sure I can, but what I mean is, like, anytime soon, like, this is gonna probably be uh, the only time I could capture one. Anyway, let's see if there's anything else here. Wow. So there is something else here. I guess I got the rare catch, and right now it's, um... Pre... Looks like, um, Hoppy has... Or Hap... Hoppit. Excuse me, I guess I captured its... Evolution was more... Rare than the... Other evolution. Um... I would just say, just get Skip Loom over a Hoppy, unless you want... Pop it, excuse me. That way you can deal with, not deal with its training. Anyway, we'll see if there's any other Pokemon here. If not, then I'll just show off the list from version 13.5. I mean, 13.0. Okay, after a while, um, there's not seem to be anything else here, but there was something else here that's rarer than, uh, than the one I just captured on Skip Loom. There we go. Um, then here's the list. I guess I can now turn off on speed mode. Nothing else I can do out here. Books! I love, dang, I can't do anything with the books. Guess I'll go ahead and check out Skip Loom real quick. Oh, excuse me. Ah, oh, Leap Guard, that's such an iffy uh, ability. In this, so that's plus defense minus special attack. Who knows? Maybe it's maybe the um. It was a cock. No, 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 no. Uh, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, jump Pluff. Um, I've actually only ever used Jump Pluff like one time. I never use it again. I think I could have off also check. You know what? I'm gonna check its stats. Thankfully, I don't need to sign out. I mean, like cut away from it. Huh huh. Huh. Huh that's not very great. It's more of a tank than it is an attacker. Plus it could be a mix attacker. Plus it speeds decent. Hmm. And maybe for early game. 
in like mid to late game it's not going to get much use. Oh well, who cares. I'm going to evolve it right away if I want to. Okay, let's look at those IVs then. Luck is on my side once again. Look at those IVs. I got 231s and it's HP and attack. And a whore at number one in speed at... Okay then. Maybe, um... HP could swap with speed. That would have been a lot better. But... What do you do? I'll take it though. Even though I already have a better grass type. Who I have not chosen to evolve yet. Okay, I'm back. I really, really should have bought some Paralyze heals. I think before we go, even go into the next episode, I should probably buy some of those, so that way we don't have that issue. You shouldn't be here right now. Master Indri... Indraid... Indri... whatever. Please forgive us. So I'm guessing we're not supposed to be out of our room right now. And speak of the devil. Hmm. What? What are you doing in my room? Did I tell you to leave? You can't stay here. Wait, little girl. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. Oh, don't worry. I'm not a pervert. <laughs> what? You actually follow me? But please, just tell me what you want. My friends. Like I said before, I don't know where they are. They're certainly not the manner. I have looked everywhere for them, I swear. I don't understand why you won't leave. Before you said you felt safe, but if you really don't leave soon... It's because you haven't given up, right? Even though my father's endless cruelty, you decide to push on. Your bravery, it's so admirable. I mean, admir admirable. I wish I were brave like you, then maybe. Maybe I could even... Grrr, uh, I decided I'm going to help you get your friends back. I'm t tired of being afraid. I want to help. Father may be strong, but, but I won't let that scare me anymore. Sorry for such a late introduction, but... but my name is Marionette. Now that you know my name, what's yours? Santendo. Okay, I get it. I got it. Santendo, if we're going to pull this off, I think the best thing to do is to confront Father head, head on and let him know. I, I know it sounds like a bad idea, but if Father finds us snooping around, he'll be extremely angry. Father is strange. If we set, if we set this up to be some sort of game, he'll agree to it. He loves to be cruel and put people through horrendous tri trials. It's entertainment for him, or perhaps something more. I don't know what, but please trust me. He's on the same floor as as this one. We should hurry, or it'll be too late. Mariana, join the Nintendo. Or technically join the party. Marionette has joined your party. She will have new things to say depending on your location. Spending time and talking to her will benefit you in the long run, so don't be shy. I like to play princess in the castle. By Dai By Dale Caddy is my trusted trusty guard. Cat sometimes father gives her this thing. It makes her far stronger than usual. Hmm. Interesting place we're in. Yeah, I'm getting tired. Maybe we should sleep for a bit? Actually, what's through this door? I've actually never been back here yet. This is the library. There are lots of weird books here. There was one about a woman who could control ice and a woman who ex who was exiled with swords. Except Weber with swords. They're lovely stories. Mm. 
The Legend of Kai Kyrilla's Altar. Long after the war between the Seven Nations. Oh, that's. I'm thinking. Of, I don't know why I was thinking of Avatar. <laughs> uh, the Last Airbender. Long after the war between the Seven Nations, practice of ancient rituals have continued in secrecy. The home of, Kr of Kyrell. Kyrella was located deep within the woods of Avia. One. One. Kyrella died, her subordinates took her estate and turned it into a place of worship for their goddess Melo Meloetta? Oh yeah, Meloetta. Kryal's subordinates were known to be radical cultists that per that per participate in mass sacrificial rituals. It was rumored that underneath her mansion lay the gigantic altar where these rituals would take place. Cirella's Cire spirit was angered by the radical in the logical that her subordinates had taken and corrupt and crept up from her grave. She took the earth and whipped out her own fa faction within one night. History S. Range family of Cirello then took her mansion and protected it from being used in harmful ways ever again. Sierra's soul sleeps soundly. Okay, so it's only these two then. The Queen with Crystal Swords. Long ago, there existed the Queen of Avia. She was revered. She was re revered by her people and respected by the smaller kingdoms that exit that existed under her wing. On the battlefield, she fought with her army as she thought of if her people's life were on the line, then hers should be as well. By the gods, she was blessed with dual crystal swords. She dubbed as. Benevol... Ben... Benevolence? And Malevolent... Malevolence. Two halves the same coin that stuck together in unison. One never overpowered the other and never flattering. It was with these very swords that the queen ended the war. May peace last forever after. Hmm... Interesting stories. I wonder if they're going to be of any importance. Before we talk to the maids, let's see what's down here. I like jumping. I like jumping the stairs, even though it's dangerous. He. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, there's not much to say about this room. It's empty. Hmm. <laughs> Storage deposit. Locked. Locked. This is the main living room. I hate this place the most. It's for fun or size for the most part. The vibe in here just... It's too much. Last time I came out this way, it was a pool sign. I wonder what it's going to be this time. Locked like usual. So what about my... Okay, guess not that way. Wasn't that where I came out from though? Oh no, it was this room. I had, like a... I had to compete a sliding puzzle to free you. The, com the complete image is so, so weird, don't you think? It looks like a girl, but it's not me. Who is it? Uh, did you ever live in a huge house before? What? Really? You're just like me then. I think I would prefer a small house though. 
It takes so long just to go to one room. I want comfiness. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, I guess we'll... Actually... What did she say right here? Okay, it's just the same thing. You, what are you doing out of your com confinement? Um, excuse me, but please let us through. We wish to speak with... Master Indurate isn't seeing any guests at this point. Guests? I'm his daughter! I can't do anything more for you. But fine, maybe I'll just cause trouble and get Father to leave his room. Imagine how furious he'll be if he, if he found out that you all just let me cause but problems. Who knows what would happen in that that case? I suppose we could let you through for just a little while. But I beg you, please behave in his presence. Phew! That was scary. I thought I was gonna puke. <laughs> but but that was just a practice around for what's going to happen next. He really. I don't remember allowing anyone to enter this room. Father, and why is Sotendo out of his confinement? You freed Sotendo, Marionette? Y yes, I freed Sotendo. So not only are you disobedient, but you are also a traitor. I could not have imagined I've ever raised such a distrustful and disgusting child. Call me what you will, fine, but we're not here for this. We're here because we decided to fight back against you. Is that so? I propose a game for the souls of everyone you're keeping captive, here. You have nerve, girl. Too much of it, perhaps. But I must admit, your, pro your position intrigues me. I'm surprised by your individual. In that weather. Speak then. What are your conditions? Santino and I will rescue everyone, and if we're successful, we all get to leave without interference. In addition to that, you will close the path to this world. That way, the <clears throat> excuse me. That way, the conclusion of the world and the world Santino's from will cease. And what if you're not successful? What happens then? Then you claim ownership of all of our souls, myself included. I'm including myself in this game. It's all or nothing. I won't back down from this. Your stubbornness reminds me of your mother. But that being said, I accept these terms. Throughout this matter, there are three fields, each with a trial I shall present to you. At the end of each trial is a soul of one of your friends. Freedom and freedom is yours. G got it. You'll get right on it then. I will be absent from here on out to ensure that there is no interference in this game. I'll be waiting to see just what you two can accomplish. Oh boy, we have a bit of a high risk, high reward going on here. The hell is so scary. I didn't expect that to work out like it did. But now we have to complete trials if we want to save everyone. Okay, Santana, together we can do this. We'll save your friends and your world. Hey, since we're working together now, that means we're a team now, right? I have read stories about leaders and groups having cool nicknames. In that case, do, do you mind if I give you a nickname? Sure. Ooh, what? <laughs> What's with these rare? <laughs> okay, screw it. Oh, what? Uh, really? Thank you so much. I was so excited. You seem so confident. Always keep your head high, like an eagle. I'm gonna call you that from now on, if that's okay. Come on, eagle. Let's win this game. Okay, it looks like we have ourselves a game right here that we're gonna have to be dealing with if we want to free our friends. So, next time on Pokemon Rejuvenation. We'll be doing just that to save our friends. 
If you enjoyed today's episode, please share, like, subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you all for the next episode. Have a nice day.